Food for the gaming here, and today we're going to be checking out different shell types and seeing which ones are the best. Or which shell is the best. Well, can be the most useful again in any situation. So if you do enjoy this video of Stormworks, make sure you drop a like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you know when I'm going to be uploading next. Anyway, let's join the video. So, I have uh, got this little gun here. We've got a muzzle brake on it, and we'll be shooting that ship. That's going to be our target for today. Today is well, very well armed and big. So, it can take a few hits. Anyway, let's show you go over the shells we got. And not off the dock. Let's just not. Let's just not go flying off the dock, that would be good. Um, got Kinetic, which is Florida Linux, Petroleum HE, and it, it doesn't have explosive properties in it. Yeah, we've got a Fragmentation, a bit like HE, but it shoots fragments. Got AP, which has just so kind of penetration. Like when I tested this before, it just went straight through the boat. So really good for taking out and incendiary, which has a small a bit, of, a bit of a chance to set the ship on fire, which can be put out but does like no damage. Anyway, let's uh, load kinetic up. We'll be going down in this order. Kinetic loaded. Ooh, that's a good hit. It has some explosive properties in it. A bit like APHE, but it doesn't explode inside the hive. Let me just get a bit closer here. Okay, as you can see, we've hit right on the number. So that does a pretty decent amount of damage, like it's destroyed some blocks. Something like that. See, so it has a bit of penetration in it. Right, it goes a bit deep, but HE does a little bit more damage and probably does a little bit But Kinetic, I'm not sure what the benefit of Kinetic is, but yeah. Okay, HE now. Experimenting with high explosive. Just it does explosive damage in a ball, basically. Turn that tower into a little bit. Readjusting, that seems good. Fire. And that is HE for you, as you can see, that's just a perfectly round circle. Let's see the interior the interior damage. Inside that, as you can see, a lot smaller kinetic penetrates like this goes a little deep, but he she just goes like all the way down. We even have a fire down here. Oh, we directly smacked into the engine room. Right, that's, that explains and that's why there's an engine fire because AP would just probably go straight through so. Yeah, so I think double layers of armor would really do better against, but as you can see, it just does a lot more penetration damage, like it penetrates a lot more than kinetic, or a little bit more. It does a bit of explosive damage and can set fires if it hits the right spot. Anyway, we have fragmentation next. Probably, in my opinion, one of the worst rounds because probably be better against infantry, but I think that's what it's designed for. But it really, is like no infantry in So I'm not sure what the point of it is. Maybe if you're playing like multiplayer or something, it's like you knock it a little bit. There we go. And straight in the same spot. 
I blew something up. I don't know like that. Yeah, that was a bit low. So it just went completely over. I can fix that. We got that. That's a bit better. Sorry if the microphone's volume just varies a lot. It's just getting it close to my mouth is quite hard when you're using a headset. That doesn't really work. So, this is frag. But it does shoot a lot of fragments, like as you can see, the fragmentation on all these blocks. But overall, probably is a bit similar to kinetic, but fragmentation. And I'm not sure that's got stackable, but I might reset the ship so we can get a proper reading on that proper damage of the thing. Switch back to AP. Okay, AP just penetrates so much. Like, like I went straight through the ship, but there really wasn't much in the middle. Okay, that's AP. Let's see how much it penetrated. Yeah, AP is also a very good shell. A surprisingly good shell. Like, so it yeah, basically got all the way to the other side of the ship. As you can see, initial impacts when it does the most damage. Like, it comes through here, like, hits a few. Like, if you really want to strike deep, like, inside a thing, like, I hit an engine, like, very well, I highly recommend the shell. It's a really good shell. But I do think HE is probably the, one of the better ones. So it just has a very similar amount of penetration, it really isn't that much stuff that's that thick. But HE won't do damage to it. Probably be a lot less effective against space armor, so that's the only time I'd recommend AP. But... Okay, let's see what we got in the area. The next one, final, final shell. There's a chance to get not off, but there's like no regular damage. Fire. I see. We ignited the fire. Right there, as you can see. It's a full mount drilling, but it. Did actually absolutely no penetration on that. Like a little gap, but that's just incidental. But so then it can be effective to slow people's damage repair down. So I repair against it. Because I got that incidental like very close to the engine. So if I could land an AP shell lock in the engine room, I'm trying to get the engine room to see like. If that could ignite a fire, if I hit the right spot in the engine room. Yeah, anyway, I think the best possible shell is HE. Because it does a lot of damage, it has a decent amount of penetration on it, and it also has a chance to ignite a fire if it hits the right thing. So HE is one of the best shells. I think AP would be second, then kinetic, then centenary, and, and fragmentation. Because the centenary actually has a chance of going on a fire flag, it just shoots fragmentation. But you might as well just use AP.
plant. You see, I hit something. Some of those are masks. And oh, I think I should move them. That doesn't matter. Spreading into the ocean. So, yeah, it's a and through here. And it didn't come out because I don't think it came out. Came out here, but it didn't penetrate. Um, yeah, AP sounds very really weird. Sure. But it's a very good ship. I'm doing a lot of internal damage to it. I'm not sure. I'm like it can go basically through this entire section. But it shoots out very tiny bits. And it has something in a pink. There was a lot of stuff in the structure. You can see the initial here. It looks like tons of damage. And then it's, uh, it comes through here, does a lot of damage to the roof. It goes through here. So, very interesting shell. So, the best shell is HE. That's me, my pillow, but you can go in the corner. If you enjoyed this video of Stormworks, make sure you like and subscribe. See you guys later.